Hello friends and family, it's your boy Destiny, we're back again with a brand new edition. I want to say a very big thank you to all my subscribers. If this is the first time joining us in this platform, please don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Don't forget to like and leave a comment down below. Today I'm going to be doing a reaction to a song by Adu Alem Gosar. Oh my god! Wow! And it's titled Gungume. Bro, I don't really know if I'm pronouncing this correctly. If I'm not, I'm very, very sorry. It was a request actually from Homie right here. So we talk about this much of the time, guys. Let's get on to you guys. Let's go. Okay. Whoa. Bro, like, I just love this beat, bro. This beat is just everything for me. This will way he started bro like like i always say my first impression matters bro like this beat is just everything and this stuff in the in this this stuff you know someone told me before that this stuff is a part of the oromo tribe from ethiopia right it's part of their culture and everything bro it's literally bro like you don't see this often bro i saw this in a song i reacted before and i was like whoa what is this and someone told me in the comment section that it's part of the uh oromo tribe right the oromo culture and everything so it is what it is let's just keep on going guys let's keep on going Literally, this song is just too powerful, bro. Like, you can literally feel the strength and the power of this song from his voice, bro. This song is powerful, man. Bro. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, but yeah, 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 bro, man, like, you can literally see, bro, you see strength, right? When you talk about strength, it, it, it does not literally mean, ah, doing this whole, no, the voice, you see the voice, bro, bro, man. Now, bro, what is the name of this dance, bro? I've never seen this dance before, bro. I literally know it's Kista, right? This this one like this. This one is powerful, bro. Bro, bro. Ethiopia is full of different cultures, bro. Different cultures. You see what I what I always say, bro. Ethiopia is literally blessed with so many cultures, so many heritage, and bro, that country is just too blessed, bro. Like what like what else do you want from Ethiopia that they don't have? They literally have everything, bro. Irrespective of the whole stuff that has been happening in Ethiopia and everything, bro, bro. If we if we should allow love lead, bro, that country, Ethiopia, bro, no, bro. Literally, Ethiopia is the mother of Africa. Everyone knows this, but the majority of people from Africa be like, ah, oh, no, bro, not Ethiopia, bro. This, the bro. If you literally go to Ethiopia, bro, you can see the infrastructures and the development going on there, bro. You you will hush them out. You just. You will keep your mouth shut, bro. It is what it is. You will keep your mouth shut because Ethiopia is literally blessed. Like, bro. But most times, people, when things happen in Ethiopia, people tend to like, ah, oh, okay, you see, this, this is happening in Ethiopia. People tend to, 
talk about the bad side of people that's what people pray on you get me like when you do something good people don't talk about it but when they see something bad like just want something that is bad about a person or a community or a country they'll be like oh now you see what is going on there you see Ethiopia is this bro listen everybody all country have their own challenges America have their own challenges the UK have their own challenges everybody literally have their own challenges so when it comes to Ethiopian tour no one should start raising up their hands and say blah bro just keep your mouth shut bro like seriously it is what it is this country like I've been to Ethiopia before I, I've seen how they live and everything bro like Bro, they are peace loving people, bro. Irrespective of anything, bro. It is what it is. Let's keep on going, bro. Literally, man, the 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 sound and the way he sing it with the tone is literally different. Cause this is or or Oromic language, right? This is literally Oromo music, right? And the tone is different from uh, Amharic music, bro. But you can literally feel the the power, bro. You literally feel the strength from his voice, bro. Like, bro, I don't even have words to say. Like most times when you want to do reactions to song, you'll be like, okay, um, this country, like. Like a country as a whole, right? You're like, okay, a country consists of different tribes and different um, religion and everything. And when people want to say some, some stuff, they'll be like, okay, uh, the whole country, this song from this tribe is better from this song. But bro, when it comes to Ethiopia, bro, their song, bro, their song, their culture. See, it's just too important to them. It's just so powerful, bro. You don't have words to say. Bro, like, I don't I don't have to say it in words, bro. Like, just travel to Ethiopia and see for yourself. Like, the time I traveled to Ethiopia, it was during the, uh, it was during, during the celebration time, right? And there were, and, and there were lots of, like, military people, a lot of policemen outside and everything. And the way they were talking, I heard some words like, uh, Ma, uh, man, oh, what is that word again? Uh, mal, mal kam, hulu mal kam, something like that, like, uh, al makam, hulu mal, something like that, like, they said it was Oromic language, bro, bro, like, these people, they're just, like, when you say Ethiopia, like, for example, I want to say, like, Nigeria, for example, right, I can't just say Nigeria, Nigeria consists of a lot of people, uh, you have the Yorubas, you have the Igbos, you have the Hausas, you have people from Edo state, you have people from different states, you have uh, different people, right? That's Nigeria, right? When you talk about Ethiopia, man, to just, to just keep the long story short, man, like, Ethiopians are just so blessed, bro. Everybody, like, the collectiveness of the whole tribe and everything, the Romos, the Amaras, the Tigrayans, you have the Afar tribe, you have the Walaitans, you have the, bro, Different people, even the uh, the, the is it was it is it the Hadians, right? The different people, bro. Like you have the Guragays, you have the Walitans, you have the Adia, you have bro, literally different tribes in Ethiopia, bro. Different tribes. Like when you want to fight a common enemy, right? When you want to fight a common enemy and you are divided, huh? They can literally penetrate and get victory, right? But if you are together, bro. <laughs> the enemy will be dope. they will be scared because like this was how the Ethiopians won the whole Italian war because bro it was just imagine you can see okay let's forget the olden days like presently now right this is a new age this is the 21st century right and you see youths still singing like this with this type of fire and this type of strength in their voice bro imagine back then how they were back then bro don't even go there bro like seriously let's keep on going guys let's keep on going ethiopia is just too blessed and let's just leave it at that bro seriously oh, wow. 
First of all, it's just bro. The way he like when you were singing a powerful song and your voice still overshadowed and overpowered the whole stuff, bro. Bro, the talent is just too much, bro. Like, bro, the talent is just too much. When you see a raw talent, bro, you have to say it out, bro. How many people can do this? You can't literally do this. You just <laughs> you just have a busted throat. You can't do this. Don't even try it at home, bro. Like seriously, this is your Roma people, bro. This is a Roma music of Ethiopia, the Roma tribe. Bro, that country is just to bless. Different tribes, different different heritage and lovely people, bro. Lovely people. Bro, the Ethiopians are just on another level. If you know, you know, bro. Like, which tribe? If you listen to a song from the Amara, the song is just next level. Listen to a song from the Roma tribe, bro, it's next level. You listen to a song from the Tigrayans, bro, same thing. The Afar region, same thing, bro. Like, bro, these people have everything, bro. They literally have everything. The Tigrayans, everybody. Nah, they're just blessed on their own way, bro. It is what it is, bro. The sound I was hearing from Rufnan's song because literally hearing this, this, this deep voice, uh, something like that from the background of Rufnan's song, bro. Seriously, I literally don't have words to use for these people, bro. Like, when you hear Ethiopia, bro, I don't know what the first thing that gets to your mind, but for me, the first thing that gets to my mind is the cultural heritage, the power, bro, and the love. That's just how it is, bro. Like, nice song, bro. The strength, the power from this song is literally a match, bro. Big shout out to Adu Alem Gosar one more time. It is what it is. So, that's it, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. Till next time, I remember your boy Destiny, and we out.